Hey guys, Carbon Kid 2 here, and today we're going to be taking a look at Minecraft 1.0.0. Not since just released a new update for the game. I think it's uh, sort of coinciding with the start of Minecon, um, which I don't really know too much about because I'm over in Australia and I'm not registered and stuff like that. Um, anyway, so I'm going to show you sort of the new stuff. I've only just been having a look at it for sort of five minutes. Um, I think not just kind of implemented the stuff that was uh, already in the pre-releases. There's a new, uh, there's like a warning here now that's uh, saying a 64-bit Java installation is recommended for far render distance. You only have 32-bit. Um, my computer, actually, it's, it was handling far render distance better with this new version. It's going to be laggy because I'm recording now, but uh, hopefully you can just put up with that. So there are new items. As you can see, the um, swamp is it's got like the murky water now and it's got these um, lily pads and uh, as I said it's sort of just stuff that was uh, in pre-release before I think the the grass is kinda of mucky I think it might actually be in the items somewhere yeah there you go mycelium I think it is oh I'm not sure if that's what's here I think it might be anyway um, there's also this end stone which is obviously from the end um, and as you can sort of see there are all sorts of new items. Um, I'll give you a look at the items. I don't really know how to do this sort of um, enchantment stuff. Although, if, ah, we'll have a look at it. Um, okay, so I think I saw an enchantment table, which we'll grab and pop that down here. Okay, um, now I will grab the golden sword. Actually, I think maybe this will Spawn a dragon, let's try that out, if I go like this. No, okay, maybe not. Just let me try flying up and see if that'll work. No, okay, guess not. Maybe you have to go to the end or something. I don't really know. Okay, so maybe if I pop this in here. Okay, none of these are clickable. Oh, okay, I think they might be because I don't have levels yet. Um, I could be wrong, but I think the chickens are a bit different. Maybe a bit smaller, and they've got these little bits on their beaks. Um, I don't know, they, they seem a bit different. Anyway, um, yeah, not just change the noises, he changed the noises on the doors, um, a while ago, and, oh, and something else, which I forget, but also the, um, the noise for getting hurt, uh, a bit different now. I'll make a new world and try and show you that, um, the one I was on just then is creative, okay. So we'll just make this and I'll try and jump off something and hurt myself and you can see what it sounds like. So I'm not sure if this is the last update for Minecraft. I th think from what I gather, um, Notch is just going to keep doing these pre-releases. But then he's just released this, and by the looks of it, it's sort of a combination of all the pre-releases, or he sort of just implemented pre-release stuff into the full game. But I think he's probably going to keep adding stuff to it. I suppose the fact that he's called this Minecraft 1.0.0 sort of indicates that there's going to be more done with it. Okay, so... We're in survival mode now, and it's really, really laggy. I'll just turn up the volume quickly so that you can uh, hear this, except I need to find someone to jump off of first. Um, okay. Oh, okay, this is a bit weird. There's a cobblestone sort of a ground level on this, and I am over there. I was also in creative mode earlier, and there were some sort of um, half stone slabs that I found just uh, in the sort of environment, which is a bit weird because I didn't put them there. Um, I'm just trying to... <laughs> okay, this will have to do it and I'll just walk off this and you'll be over here. Or not. <laughs> um, I'm gonna, I'll try this one more time. Okay, so I'll pop up there. I'll just crawl over the edge. Yep, <laughs> and as you can hear, it's a really disgusting, sort of bone crunching, gory sound instead of just the classic ugh. So, yeah, that's a bit different. Um, I'll try and take another look at the new items. So, yeah, I th for some reason, and I think it's just this block, I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure Notch has changed this, uh, changed the iron block in the new release. So now it's got these sort of funny lines. It doesn't seem to have done it with uh, gold or diamond, unless. I don't know, but they haven't got these sort of funny lines. Um, I think they might be... I don't know if he's changed them. Anyway, um, so as we can see down here, I've got this nether brick, 
which I'll try placing down. And it's going to night time. That's useful. I'll just turn the brightness up. Okay. So we've also got this uh, nether brick. Not sure if uh, night time's darker now. Although it could just be looking dark because it's sort of the sun setting in this fog on. Anyway. Um, what else have we got? Okay. Um, I think that stuff's all the same. We've got um, a golden apple which looks enchanted. Um, I don't know what's going on there, but anyway, it's got that sort of glowy thing that you see when it's enchanted, and the text is purple. So maybe that's just because it's like a special item. Okay, what have we got here? We've got a blaze rod. I think this stuff's from the Nether. We've got a blaze rod, a ghast tear, a gold nugget. Um, I'm not sure if that's from the Nether. Nether wart. Well, I suppose that's probably going to be from the Nether. Glass bottle, uh, spider eye. Oh, that's right, we've got uh, more music discs, and we've got a really dodgy looking one there. Uh, Blistering Melon, Eye of Ender, I think that's, they've got something to do with getting into the Ender, but you've got to find a Stronghold, I think, and then a sort of portal thing. We've got a Cauldron, Brewing Stand, Magma Cream, Blaze Powder, and Fermented Spider Eye. I don't really know what to do with those, although, maybe you could eat these, I don't really know. Um... What I might do is try and grab a music box, and a oh, jukebox rather, and we'll have a listen to some of this new music. <laughs> it's not going to sound great because it's going to be playing through my speakers, and I'm sort of I'm not recording um, audio output from uh, my uh, computer, so it's just going to be what's coming through the speakers. Uh, okay, whatever. We'll grab this mall CD, and hopefully we can just pop it in. Okay, we'll have a listen to that. Um, I also might do it. Okay, it looks like there are different kinds of leaves. They don't really look too different, although this one looks darker. Um, but I'm sure they are different, because that's why there are uh, three of them. Um, I'll just put some glowstone down so we can see a bit better. So, as I keep saying, I, I think these new discs were in a pre-release. So, yeah. I suppose Notch is just sort of publicly releasing stuff that he's been working on with uh, Mojo. Uh, I think we've pretty much covered everything now. What I'll also show you is the new TNT noise that I forgot before. Um, I think it might have. I don't know if anything else has changed. Um, might have been this, but I forgot if it changed. Anyway, I'll pop this in the ground and we'll detonate it. Noise. Might be kind of noisy, so you might want to turn your speakers down now. Oh yeah, there's also um, a new bow and arrow noise, which I'll just show you, even though it's already it was already released before this new version. But uh, what the heck, we'll chuck it in anyway. Okay, so I'll grab some arrows. I think Notch is really just trying to make stuff sound more realistic with uh, these new noises. So I think that's just about it for this video, guys. If you're watching this and you'd like to see more stuff uh, with sort of enchantment and uh, that, this new enchantment table, um, leave a comment and I uh, might have a bit more of a look at it. But at the moment, I'm a bit clueless with this stuff. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video, guys, and I'll see you next time.